Well, here in a corner of the gallery where we often sit and have um, a coffee break is an interesting painting. Uh, talk about this. The name of this t painting is The Call to Prayer in Alanya. Alanya, you may know, is on the south coast of Turkey and a place I visited, I don't know how many years ago. And while I was there, I stood on the battlements high up above the city and I did a painting looking out over a an area of vegetation that was great, very beautiful. These parts of the painting you may see as walls and there's an old tower there snaking away in the distance. The wall goes on and on around the headland, enclosing a huge area of settlement, which is now a lot of it in ruins. And beyond that are the great mountains that surround the Mediterranean, the, the, that part of the Mediterranean. Very high mountains come close to the sea, full of uh, vegetation. Very beautiful area. Alanya on the coast. Now, while I was there, it had an, inc an incident happened. I was painting a picture of the castle, which um, I think my son has now. And there was a character right down underneath me on the battlements with two boys. And he was stooping down and picking things from the vegetation. Later on, after he disappeared and I continued my painting, he emerged from behind me. He'd come up onto the battlements. He must have seen me. And he was a mullah from one of the mosques in Konya. You know, Konya is the center of the Mevlava cult, the Sufis, where the whirling dervishes dance. It's an ecstatic, mystic, mystical um, approach to Islam. And I no doubt he was of that bent because he was full, intoxicated with his ideas of Allah. And he was telling me about Allah in Turkish, most of which I couldn't understand. All about Allah in the mountains, Allah in the sea, Allah in the in the trees and the hills, and he made me say four lines of Arabic. He kept repeating them, wanting me to say them, and it was the lines of Arabic um, that people who are converted to Islam have to say: Allah, la la, la la, something like that. I can't remember now. The precise wording, but anyway, I learned them and I said them. And when I did so, he threw his arms around my neck and called me his Arkadash, which means a friend in Turkish. And then he put his um, thumbs behind his ears and his head back, and he did the call to prayer. The Muzayim, I think it's called, that you hear being prayed from the mosques. But he did it just as a one-off on that spot. And it was one of the most beautiful sounds I've ever heard. It was, he sang it beautifully and it rang around the, the hills. And that is what I've tried to sort of capture in that painting, the ringing of that man's prayer around the hills on that extraordinary place of Alanya.